Hey, come on in, y'all. We're going to have a conversation. Welcome, welcome. Hello, hello, everybody. Come on in. Oh, I do need to tag. Yeah. Hello. Hello. We're, we are streaming live on Instagram and Facebook. So if you see us looking back and forth, that is what we're looking at. Um, hello. Hey. Why would I be in this room? That's David A. Mm -hmm. Hi. Hello. Out there in Facebook land and Instagram. We are going to have a conversation here. So we're going to wait for a few more people to join. And then we will get started with our topic of discussion for this evening. And go over a few house rules. And um, get started. So join us for a conversation. Hello, hello. Hello, good afternoon, good evening, I should say. Good evening. Good evening. We will not be on here long. We are starting a conversation and we would like feedback and interaction. I'm doing a lot of bouncing. So let me move this back just a tad so we're not hey, to... hey facebook land keep trying to figure it out so we are streaming live from facebook and instagram tag people to join the conversation yes let me turn it just a little so we can see you as well okay that's good that's good. Good afternoon. So we're not going to be on here long. We are streaming from Instagram and Facebook. We are going to have a conversation. All right. Well, we are not going to, again, hold you all long. So what we are doing is we are going to to begin um, having conversations. So be on the lookout for our YouTube page. Hello, hello. Be on the lookout for our YouTube page, Key and Kai's Exchange, where we will be having conversations about specific topics and what we would like for you all to do is join in on the conversation and give us feedback and tell us what you think. Um, I am Keela and this is Kyra, Key and Kai. And I just want to do a disclaimer. I will probably do it again during this live so that other people will have an opportunity to hear what we are saying. So the disclaimer is, we don't claim to know everything. We don't have all the answers. Um, we are just having a conversation. This is what we do, uh, Kai and I. This is what we do all the time. We have conversations and we thought that we would like to include uh, social media in the conversations that we have. So this evening's topic, um, will be about emotions. That's a big one. Definitely. That is a big one. So what you will see is you have uh, two different gener two different generations giving perspective about the topics that we'll be talking about. Again, be on the lookout for our YouTube page, Key and Kai, the Key and Kai Exchange. 
Again, we do not know everything. We don't have all the answers. This is just conversation because I believe that we lack a lot of positive conversation. And I would just like to know what you all think. And also, you will be able to get a perspective from a different generation. Um, so, um, with that being said, there's no judgment. There's no criticism. No answer is the wrong answer. We just want to know what you all think, what your thoughts are on the topics at hand. So, with that being said, um, we will get started talking about emotions and what you all think about controlling your emotions or if you're still working on it. Um, we just want your feedback. So, please feel free to chime in at any time and give us some feedback. So, um, again, we are streaming live from Facebook and Instagram. So if you see us looking back and forth, that is what we are looking at. Okay. Hey, Dina. Hey. So, so the definition of emotions is a natural instinctive state of mind deriving from one's circumstances, mood, relationships, or relationships with others. And so what that means is um, that is pretty much how we function is by our emotions. Our emotions are tied to our everyday living, how we deal with people, how we deal with relationships, whether that be an intimate relationship, whether that is um, a friendship, um, fam dealing with family members, we deal with emotions on a daily. And what I have learned, hey Bina, what I have learned is once you learn, and this is very key, once you learn how to control your emotions, you possess power. What does that mean, Keila? That simply means that if somebody is pushing your buttons, and most of the time when we're dealing with emotions, um, there are a wide range of emotions, happiness, sadness. But most of the time when we're dealing with emotions, we say we are in our feelings, right? So... When somebody is triggering you or pushing your buttons or doing things like that and you can control how you respond to that, you then possess power. I feel like personally it's a superpower because this is something that I had to learn during the quarantine that I practiced um, just because I want to be a better individual. So I started practicing, hey Sherry, hey Bree. Um, so I wanted to practice um, discipline. So I started meditating in prayer during the quarantine and also controlling my emotions. And I'll give you all a couple examples of what I am speaking of. So, and I'll just say in general, a relationship in general, um, there were some triggers and some buttons being pushed. And what I started doing is just quieting myself, just almost like, <laughs> just almost like stepping back and evaluating myself before I even respond, before I get in, get in my feelings, I check myself. And I began to realize that I possess this power. Again, it is a superpower to be able to control your emotions because so many times things happen and we react. We want to pop off, we go off. That's me. <laughs> yeah, and we, are we just keeping it real? I mean, that's just... I'm still in the process of learning how to... Yeah. 
So, I mean, and I'm still going to do I have not um, mastered this completely, but I have pretty much got the concept of how to control my emotions. And, hey, Kurt. So, again, with Kai and I having these conversations, I am helping her to practice um, just being in control of your own emotions. So, um, again, that is something that I had to work on. And when I tell y'all it's power, there is power controlling your emotions. And I know a lot of us struggle with that. And again, it's always like, you know, we want to pop off or go off on somebody. And it's not all about that. It's, it's about self-control. And that is, that's the bottom line right there. Um, so, again, uh, we welcome feedback. Uh, what we're doing is we are going to start a YouTube channel called The Key and Kai Exchange, where we are having real conversations because this is what we do every day. And we wanted to include everybody and have conversations um, with everybody and get feedback about how you control your emotions or if it's something you're still working on and just get feedback. So, um, yes, absolutely. Self-control is a must. And I mean, I'm still working on it, but I have possessed this power that I'm talking about. And you all see me kind of get a little perky and excited when I talk about it because I'm telling you, it is, it, there is something when you can control yourself in situations because people will push your buttons all the time, whether it's in public, whether it's family, friends, people will push your buttons. And when you have the power, when you possess the power to control how you respond to these type of things, this is what, what we're trying to get to. We're trying to grow. And with me helping my daughter um, to grow, you know, I just want to... Um, like offer it to you all too um, so we will be having different different topics of conversation and we want you all to chime in and uh, give us your feedback so tonight's discussion is about emotions um, hey Trevor so um, feel free to, to chime in at any time leave comments um, ask questions um, I gave a disclaimer at the beginning of this video and I said, this is a no judgment zone. There is no criticism. No, no, we, no. we don't know everything. We are just giving perspective, perspectives, excuse me, from two different generations. And that's mine and Kai's. And this is my daughter, just in case anybody didn't know. And so, um, I mean, we'll, I won't do all the talking. Um, Kai is going to give her... A perspective on emotions and being um, 22 and dealing with emotions and how she's dealt with emotions over time and um, so yeah so we'll let Kai uh, give her perspective on emotions and again feel free at any time to chime in and join a part of this conversation we are trying to grow as people and we want the people that uh, we are familiar with to also benefit from having conversations because we don't communicate effectively like we should. So again, feel free to join in at any time and don't feel any pressure. This is what we do all the time. We talk all the time and so we just wanted to include everybody. And you all will hear me say this time and time again for the people that are just joining. So make sure you stay tuned for the Key and Kai Exchange, where we will be having real conversations, just kicking it, being ourselves, and, um, you know, make sure you tag, make sure you share, make sure you like, and leave comments. That is what we are here for, is to have real-life conversations. So with that being said, Kai, um, just briefly talk about... Um, you know, how you're dealing with um, or how you deal with emotions and um, some things that you are working on. Um, so basically, uh, like I was saying, 
<laughs> basically, like I was saying, um, I'm still like working on my dealing with my emotions. And um, I think the first thing is realizing what my triggers are, um, what triggers different emotions. And um, once I realize what those triggers are, I know how to or I know what to what to go in and try to work on. Um, so, yeah, I'm definitely, I can't really give advice on how to deal with emotions because I, I still feel like I'm still in the stages of working on how to, you know, deal with my emotions. And, um, so yeah, if, if, if you guys have any input or any advice, um, the floor is definitely open. I'm definitely open to taking advice and everybody's feedback. Um, definitely, I definitely think people people know what your triggers are for sure. Yeah, and I feel like people do try to um, take advantage of that, and you know, that's another thing. It's like. When you know a person knows what your trigger, what your triggers are, that kind of make it worse for me because it's like I know you know what you're doing, so it's like I don't know. So let me let me say something. So Bree, um, I see you know you say you're right. You're learning to think about um, reactions on others' actions. And people know triggers and how to get a reaction. And then um, on Instagram, I did that and been in control ever since. So that is key right there. So again, when you know that people know your triggers and people push buttons, that is what we're talking about, being in full control. So even if you know that somebody is pushing your buttons or they're trying to get a reaction from you, again, when you... This, this power that I was talking about that you possess, this is something that you have to practice daily. It's a restraint that you have to practice because, again, people will try to push buttons. People will say things to trigger you and try to get you to respond. And um, some people do it knowingly and some people do it unknowingly. So, again, that power that you possess is when you can control how you respond to those triggers. Once you possess that, I'm telling you all, it's a superpower. It's self-control. Once you learn this level of self-control, you have it in the bag. I'm telling you. And it's, it's something that you have to work on. Again, I worked on this when we were in quarantine. Hi, CC. Hi, Liz. This is something that I worked on in quarantine with um, prayer and meditation and just um, trying to um, control my emotions because I want to be, um, I want clarity. I want positive energy and it takes so much energy. It takes so much energy, energy to react negatively to Hey, Tierra, it, it, to react to someone um, trying to push a button. When you can sit back and you can say, I'm going to let you have this. I'm going to let you have it. I'm trying to get to that point. Yeah, and I mean, we're, we're all a work in progress. <laughs> nobody, you know, nobody is perfect. Everybody is a work in progress. And so, again, what we're doing is just trying to um, I am at a different place than Kai is. Um, and so I am still a work in progress. Um, okay. So Armin said everyone needs the 12 steps in their life and we can all be better people. Um, and I am not sure exactly what all the 12 steps are, Armin, but... I mean, anything that will help you work on this self-control. Emotions, again, are a big part of how we deal with people. Whether it's negative or positive, most of the time what we're talking about here is dealing with 
negative energy and how we deal with people and emotions and people, um, you know, pushing our buttons. And so, I again, um, there is a power you possess and everybody has it. It's just it just takes work. It yes. takes time. Um, and that's, you know, some of the things that, um, hey, Jay, some of the things that I have talked to Kai about is controlling your emotions. You know, when I, I see um, different people in heated debates, you know, it's almost like, man, I wish I could just tell them, you know, that, you know, just fall back. Just just sit back. Everything does not need a reaction. Facebook, Instagram, my people, everything does not need a reaction. We don't. I'm learning that. Yeah. We do not have to always run to Facebook or run to somebody else. And this is something we have to work on personally. We have to work on self-control and our own emotions. We let so many things get under our skin and it just requires excuse me, <clears throat> it requires discipline. And that's with anything that we do. And I oftentimes say, hey, Brandy, I oftentimes say, use your power tool. Um, going through my weight loss journey, I, I apologize for that. Um, going through my weight loss journey, that is my motto. Use your power tool. Your power tool is simply your mind. Your mind is the most powerful tool you have. And, okay, I'll let you know, Liz, for sure. Um, this is definitely something we will be doing on a consistent basis. Um, but anyway, you have to use your power tools. That is so important in every aspect of your life. And it is self-control, it's working on your emotions, is building character, is making you more whole, it's fulfilling, it's rewarding. And again, there is a power that you possess when you can control your emotions. This is huge because again, every day in life, there are gonna be triggers, there are gonna be things that try to knock us off course. And if we learn this discipline of self-control, we got it in the bag, y'all. It's, it's, I mean, it's a no-brainer. And again, it's, it's going to take practice. And um, I mean, I would like to know what you all think. Um, you know, how, how do you deal with um, your emotions? Are you struggling? Do you struggle? Do you, do you pop off when somebody pushes a button, when there's a trigger? You know, how do you deal with your emotions? How how have you dealt with emotions if you have um, acquired this power of controlling your emotions, of self-control? This is what this is what we're doing. We're having real conversations and we just wanted to include you all. So I just want to know what you think. Um, there's no judgment here. Uh, we're just, this is something again, that we do all the time. We, we communicate all the time. We have conversations and we just wanted to include everybody. So I want to know what you all think. I don't want to do all the talking. Um, Kai, you know, talked a little bit about her still working on controlling her emotions. Um, uh, maybe you all have some advice. Definitely. Um, along with i mean and that's one thing we welcome again we don't know everything we don't have all the answers we just wanted to have conversations um and just open the floor to any advice or any comments about emotions that is what we're talking about if you just joined us uh stay tuned for our youtube channel the key and kai exchange and it's just having conversations about different different topics and getting everybody's input. Hey, Naya, getting everybody's input. We are on Facebook Live and Instagram Live. So feel free to join in and give us your feedback. We welcome all feedback. There is no judgment. There is no criticism. 
We don't know everything. We just want to open up dialogue and have conversations. So again, like, um, please comment, give us feedback, talk to us. Yes. That's, that's what we are doing this for because we want to open up dialogue and have conversations because we don't have real conversations about real things. You know, we just, again, we, we keep it real. Um, the main principles underneath each of the 12 steps. Let's see. All right. Thank you, Armin. So the main principles underneath the 12 steps are acceptance, hope, faith, courage, honesty, willingness, humility, responsibility, love, discipline, awareness, growth, and service. Um... Thank you, ma'am. Um, hey, Leah. I'm working on my discipline. Yes. I think my biggest problem is like, <laughs> I always feel like if somebody says something to me and I feel like it's out the way or my my first thought is, oh, well, you're not going to do me like that and I'm not going to let you get away with it. So I'm definitely vocal about how I feel and you don't know if I'm if I'm bothered because I'm gonna let it be known, and I don't hey, have man. a problem with doing it either. So it's just like it's not like you know I'm not aware of what I'm doing. I think I'm just I'm just needing help with how to deal with you know and dealing with those emotions. Right, right. And that's, I mean, that's cool because I had to get there too. You know, there was a time, like I said, I gave an example about a relationship that I had and this person, I mean, for whatever reason, just triggered me. And it seems like most of the time it's the people that are closest to you that will trigger your emotions. But instead of, how about choosing to just kind of back down and it's not letting people walk all over you. It's it's not about letting people take advantage of you because you cannot. I, I don't agree with allowing people to run over you or take advantage of you in no way, shape, or form. But I dealt with my emotions for years. There is so many things. We are, we are definitely going to tap into a lot of conversation so y'all listen this is this is gonna be epic and especially for me because i have i know it's not being um i'm not bragging or anything but i have grown so much i have acquired so much knowledge about myself and being younger i dealt with my emotions in a way where my attitude was foul um and I shut down in a different way. I'm talking about shut down where, you know, I'm not talking. Um, and again, this was way younger. I'm talking about breaking stuff. Um, pretty much having a, a tantrum, a fit, because I did not know how to control my emotions. It wasn't until my latter age that, that I am now during the quarantine that I obtained this power that I'm talking about, controlling my emotions. And I, I cannot say it enough, use your power tool. And again, I have said that that is my motto. It has been my motto on my weight loss journey, using your power tool because your mind is so powerful. You know, we say we have to be careful what we put into the atmosphere. That's another big one. You have to be careful. Well, I, I can't control it. I'm not going to let, you know, we, we want to pop off and, oh, we not going, I'm not going to let nobody talk to me any that's kind me. of way. I'm not, you know, you, <laughs> all of the, that's too much energy for me. You know, I, I'm in a different place. I'm not trying to do all of that extra, you know, uh, going off and all. it's not worth it to me. It's so much easier and so much more rewarding to take a step back and before you even uh, speak, think before you speak. That is huge. And, and again, when you possess that power, 
I'm, I'm telling you, it's a superpower. When you have control over your response to negative energy, you possess power. Listen, y'all, I get excited when I say it because I have experienced this power of being able to control my emotions. It is the most rewarding. It is the most rewarding feeling ever for somebody to, you know somebody is trying to get under your skin. You know somebody is trying to push your buttons. And when you can have restraint, and when you can say, you can have it, you you got that one. That's, that's on you. Dealing with situations, and I wrote something a while ago, just taking uh, mental notes um, about emotions. I saw somewhere, and this is, this is on relationships. And maybe you all agree, maybe you don't, that's fine. Everybody has their opinion, and we are not here to judge or say right or wrong or indifferent. But um, I heard somebody talking about in a relationship, if someone, if somebody cheats in a relationship, if you are not tied to, if you are not tied to them in marriage, you're dating, and someone cheats in a relationship, we know that a lot of times the first thing we want to do is pop off, is go off. You cheated on me, you da 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 da. But when you learn how to control it, that is on them. When you learn how to control your emotions, and we're 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 just tapping into relationships, uh, and we're talking about a spouse. Um, you know, when somebody does something in a relationship like cheating, it's not to say you get walked or you did that. You have to suffer those consequences, whatever that is. Whatever those consequences are, whatever happens, that is on them. For you to get all out of character and want to tear stuff up and cuss them out and go off the energy. For what? That's on them. Whatever you do, whatever choices and decisions you make, that is what you have to deal with. And when you learn how to, again, control your emotions, you possess so much power. And, and using your power to is, I can't say it enough. It's, it's every, everybody, we are all a work in progress. And uh, that's what we want to do. Um, Again, it's open up the floor and have dialogue with everybody and just see what what you think. Um, and, you know, we will be doing um, advertisement. Just, just a quick little commercial break here. We will be doing um, advertisements for small businesses. Um, and again, we are just going live. We are... Letting you all know that we will have a YouTube page coming called the Key and Kai Exchange, where we will be, yes, very excited. This is going to be good. Um, where we will be just, we will be having open dialogue and conversation. So right now we're just getting the word out. So you all like, comment, share, um, and be ready to subscribe to our Instagram page, the Key and Kai Exchange, where we will be having open dialogue, no judgment. This is open to any and everybody. Um, so make sure, you know, you, you tag, you share, and let people know that we're just having real conversations. Again, this is what Kai and I do all the time, and we just wanted to include um, everybody else in the conversation because this is what we do not do is communicate well uh, with one another and just have conversations. So, um, hey, Trace, so this is what we want to do is just open up the floor for dialogue, for you all to give information. Tonight we talked about emotions and we are going to wrap this up. And, um, you know, again, we just want your feedback. Um, we're just having open conversation uh, because we 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 don't communicate. I mean, we talk to who we talk to, but really having conversations about real things, you know. And I know it's not just Kai and I that have questions and 
and thoughts and we want to know what other people think. We are together every day, all day long, and we talk about any and everything together. So we wanted to include uh, you all here on uh, Facebook and Instagram. And again, just get feedback. So um, again, make sure you like, comment, subscribe, and be on the lookout for the Key and Kai Exchange. Open dialogue, open, open conversations. Tonight's topic was emotions. If you all would like to leave a comment, leave a comment or you can inbox either one of all, either one of us uh Keila D it's in Puddin on um Facebook and my social media is Kai Cozy Kai for everything Kai Cozy for everything and then um Keila it's in Puddin I yeah listen I'm I'm 43 I don't remember I mean, just when I get on there, that's what I remember. But anyway, that's neither here nor there. But if you have any questions or comments um, and you didn't want to say anything on either live, um, Facebook or Instagram, uh, feel free to inbox either one of us and we'll bring it up on the next live. Um, again, we will be promoting other businesses. So if you have a business or you know someone that has a business, feel a free message. to send a message Definitely. by comment or inbox so we can advertise your business. And drum roll. Yeah. So the first, <laughs> so the first. Small business I want to put out there is be on the lookout for Puddin's Pieces. Yes, sir. Be on the lookout for Puddin's Pieces. That is my brand. I have some exciting things coming. Make sure y'all tap in. Again, I will be advertising other businesses as well be on the lookout for puddings pieces again puddings pieces hey dion again look out for puddings pieces that's me i'm pudding thank you hey cousin so yes tonight's uh topic of conversation was emotions um and again, if you still want to tap in, leave a comment, inbox. We talked about, just to recap before we log off, um, we've been on here quite a while. I feel like, y'all, I have done a lot of talking, but um, we will engage um, more. I will definitely engage more. Um, definitely. I feel like this was, this, this, um, uh, this life for me was definitely uh, beneficial because I feel like I was a sponge in this life. I wish you guys would have gave a little bit more feedback, but you know, we'll get there. Yeah, we'll definitely. But I definitely get there. did um, gain gain a few uh, tips and pointers from just sitting here and listening. That's cool. That is the ultimate goal is to gain something. We are all learning together. We are all trying to be better individuals, all trying to be better people. And I want everything that is attached to me to win. So however we can, hey family, however we can um, have this dialogue and get conversation going. That's all we want to do is get conversation going. Again, this is something we do all the time. So it's a little easier for us to just kick it with each other and give feedback and give our opinions. But we wanted to um, open it up for everybody else. We are on Facebook and Instagram Live right now. So you see us kind of um, looking back and forth. Um, in both cameras here. Um, and yes, I do agree that. Thank you so much, Bree. You have given so much feedback. I definitely. love it. That is what we're looking for. But you definitely 
have power to make better choices. And that is what we're trying to do. We are trying to be better. Y'all, it's 2022. It's time out for the being petty, the, the beefing back and forth. We got so much going on in the world. So much loss and so much, you know, so many people grieving. And we just want to open up again dialogue for uh, fulfilling conversations. Um, I'm all about the positivity, no negativity, um, growth and development, strengthening your mind, strengthening your body. Um, again, be on the lookout for our YouTube channel, The Key and Kai Exchange, where we will be having open conversations about different topics. Um, so just make sure you all uh, tap in. I'm sorry, I tried to wave at y'all and it's the camera thing. Bro. Anyway, so yeah, be on the lookout. Also, we will be advertising small businesses. Tab, I'll see you on here. Um, so if you want your business advertised um, and put out there, make sure you comment and leave your business name, any information that you want us to put out there and we will definitely advertise your business because again, we are all about positivity and growth. And we want to see everybody win. We not just talking about it. We not just we not just talking. It's not just you know. I just want my people to win. No, I want. We that. Yeah, we definitely on that. I I want to see everybody win. I want to see everybody prospering. Um, and exactly, life is short, and still holding on to grudges. That's not even better that's not better for your life in no way exactly um we will be hey ma hey cousin um we will be doing this um a couple times a week uh, we don't have a set schedule yet also another quick announcement be on the lookout for putting's pieces i am putting it out there that is my brand, Puddin's Pieces. Support you guys. Yes. Hey, Mom. Support. Yes, we. I definitely have, um, not just y'all, this is one of the t-shirts that I made. I put a little bling on there, but this is one of the t-shirts that I made. I won't just be doing only t-shirts. There are some other exciting things coming. My goodness, I'm so excited about this. So be on the lookout for that. Also, be on the lookout. I, I can't say it enough. Y'all going to hear me say it all the time. Be on the lookout for the Key and Kai Exchange on YouTube. We will be going live, having dialogue about different conversations, communications, hair, fashion, shoes. Um, we Tonight, we started off with emotions. Um, communication, I think I said that. That's, ooh. That's a huge one. Definitely. And that is what we're doing is having a conversation. We're communicating. We need your feedback. We want to hear what you have to say. We want to open up communication. Again, we talk to who we talk to, but we don't do things like this. I mean, there's podcasts, but we're taking it to a different level. We want y'all to see us. We want to interact with people. We are, y'all, listen. So don't I'm be telling afraid to comment. Don't be afraid to comment. We just being us. We just kicking it with y'all. Uh, we don't get to see everybody. This is just us. We don't know everything. We're just having conversations. So please, hey, Jazz. Welcome, welcome. Hey, Jazz. Um, again, we are just kind of wrapping it up here. But again, we talked about emotions. If you want to leave comments or inbox or you have our numbers, please send us a message. If it's something that you didn't get a chance to say or that you want to say, um, please, please, please feel free to leave us a text message, inbox, comment. Um, we will be advertising small businesses. So if you want your business advertised, please send let us know. Send us a message. Tell a friend. Send a comment. Yes, absolutely. Tell somebody to tell somebody. We're trying to grow, y'all. It's a whole different year. Life is short and not promised. 
And we want everything attached to us to win. And this is one of the ways we are opening up this lane. Um, will it be the same time all the time? Uh, we are definitely working on that. We just wanted to open up the floor and uh, let everybody know that this is what is coming. So we will work out all the kinks and details. Um, hey, hey, love. So we're, we're working out all the kinks and details. Um, we just wanted to get it out here and we will definitely let you all know um, when we will be going live. Um, and so we just randomly picked a topic today and it was emotions. Very good conversation. I was excited about talking about emotions because Honey, we be in our feelings here. I be ready to fight. <laughs> I mean, just keeping it real. You know, um, if y'all didn't hear what she said, she said she she be ready to fight. And that is what we're working on. Um, we're definitely working on trying to control our emotions and use our power tools. That's huge for me. That is my motto for my weight loss journey. Lose, I mean, use your power. Look, lose. Y'all, y'all see what's on my mind, right? <laughs> but using your power tool, um, you know, that is that's huge. I'm telling you, when you learn how to control your emotions again, you possess power. When you know how to use your power tool, your mind, when you can control how you respond to negativity, you will possess power. We are still, I'm still a work in progress. This is something that I have worked on. This is something that I didn't understand as a young person, why my emotions were all over the place, but I did not know how to control them. And that's fine, growth is huge. And I'm growing, I'm getting to a better place and trying to help Kai as well as you all too. Go ahead. But I was just going to say, um, I think it's important that, like, whenever I have kids, I think, um, I mean, by that point, I I would have been, I've learned, I would have learned how to um, control my emotions and have that power. And I definitely want to instill that into my children while they are babies so that when they get my age, they know what to do when... They're dealing with different emotions. They know how to handle different emo emotions or when people trigger them, they know how to handle the situation. So I think that's like the most important thing is teaching your babies how to, you know, deal yeah. with emotions while they are babies. So again, like I said, when they when they get older, they know what to do in those situations. Not not let me say this because I am a mom. But not just when they get older, when they get your age, but you want to teach them from a, um, like you said, from a baby, you want to teach them how to handle situations without reacting in a negative way. Um, and we see um, how, and, and, and babies have to be taught. They have to be molded. And so with teaching them the, the way to handle emotions it's not to hit back or right. bite or kick or punch. Um, we want to teach them how to control their emotions as children, as babies. So when they're growing and they get to school, if somebody is picking on them or trying to push their buttons, they know how to react. They won't react with violence or saying mean things or saying things that are going to hurt somebody else's feelings because they have been taught and it has been instilled in them to control their emotions. It, uh, and uh, Bree said, true, because lack of communication can cause bad emotions. True. My goodness. We are going to talk about communication. Um, so that will probably be our next topic of discussion because communication is huge. Yeah. There is such a breakdown in communication with us as individuals, period. And again, we will run to somebody, girl, um, so-and-so said this or said that, and we go off of that and play off of each other instead of having a communication. And, and the word says, 
If you have an aunt against your brother or sister, you are supposed to go to them. You're not supposed to be running your mouth here and there and everywhere. Get on Facebook Live. Get on well, Facebook I Live. Get Facebook. I never understood why people get mad and then go to Facebook Live, record themselves, or go on there and crying, crying and cussing and going off <laughs> and all of that type of thing. Instead of having a conversation. Again, this that's another topic. We're going to get into communication and all of that. Pops. My mom said positive teachings is critical. I absolutely agree. Definitely. And that is what we want to do is just uh, create a lane of positivity. There is so much stuff going on. We just want to open the floor and uh, bring about some positivity and some, and some good conversation and feedback. And again, we just kicking it. This is simply... This is simply it. This is going to be epic. So again, before we get off here, I am so glad you all joined us this evening in our live and a couple announcements and I am getting off of here for real because I already said it was over. Thank you so much, Ma. I really, really appreciate that. Um, so again, just a quick re recap. We talked about emotions this evening. Um, and what we are doing is I want you all to be on the lookout for uh, the key. And Kai Exchange. Hey, Annette. The key um, and Kai Exchange. The key and Kai Exchange. Be on the lookout for our YouTube page. The key and Kai Exchange. Oh, my God. Stop. <laughs> but <laughs> this, we just, we just kicking it, y'all. Uh, we are live here on Facebook and Instagram if you see us looking back and forth. Um, again, we talked about emotions. Be on the lookout for our live YouTube, The Key and Kai Exchange, where we will be having open dialogue. I did a quick disclaimer at the beginning, and I've done it throughout the video, and said this is not a judgment zone. There is no judgment here. We don't know everything. We are just having a conversation. We just kicking it because this is just us. This is what we do all the time, all day long. We talk to each other. So we just wanted to include everybody and um, just have open dialogue. Um, I can't say it enough. Oh, thank you so much, bro. <laughs> no, it didn't throw us off at all. Um, anyway, be on the lookout for that. We will also be advertising small businesses. So if you have a business, make sure you comment. Make sure you inbox either one of us. Um, if you have our numbers and you want your business advertised, please make sure you text us your business information. Whatever you want advertised, that's what we will put out there. We want to support everybody that's doing something because we want the support back. And you guys share... Share yeah, the share as well. Share Spread the word. Let people know that you know this is something that's gonna be. It's gonna be happening. This is going This is this is happening. Definitely. This is so, happening. This is 2022. Spread the word. This is about to What's be up, so man? epic, y'all. I'm so excited. I'm sorry. I'm so excited. This is crazy. This it is definitely going to be lit. We are uh on to something different uh brie said time to make the devil mad because this is the movement that part right there it is definitely i love you too cousin that is definitely what we want to do we want to make the devil mad he has run havoc and personally i'm sick of it <clears throat> i am sick of it so that's what we want to do if we all about positivity and um, just getting the word out there. So anyway, um, again, just ending this video, the key and Kai exchange. The key and Kai exchange. Look out Spread for it. Spread the word. Spread the word. It's going to be live YouTube. I will let everybody know um, when the next time we will go live. And y'all be ready to give some feedback. Um, again, hey, love. Again, um, hey. thank you all, uh, Bree. My goodness, thank you so much for your feedback. Thank you for watching. I, we love you all so, so much. We want everybody to win. 
We want everybody attached to us. This is not just words. We are all about promoting um, everybody. We want everybody to win. And, um, you know, we just want to get it out there. Also, be on the lookout for Putin's pieces. I put it out there for the world to know. Hey, I'm so excited, y'all. Be on the lookout for Putin's pieces. This is one of the shirts that I did. You all have seen some of the shirts that I have pressed. This will not be the only thing that I will be doing with Puddin's Pieces. There is something big coming, so be on the lookout for that. Puddin's Pieces, the Key and Kai Exchange, we're having we open... Going up. Yeah, we definitely going up. Going we up are sure. definitely going up. Hello, Alyssa. Um, so be on the lookout for all of those great things. Again, we love you all. Thank you all for tuning in and giving us your time. Y'all, be ready to, to we want to have some conversations. We want to have some real conversations, and we want to talk about some things, and we want to get your perspective, and we got two different generations here, 43, 22, about to be 23, and again, two different perspectives from two different generations, and this is great because you'll get my perspective from my generation her perspective from her generation and eventually we'll be able to let people join in and um you know go live with everybody else so again with that being said we have been on here a good hour i have done a lot of talking this is very different for me but i listen thank you so much thank love you. um but yes, this is a new venture for us, and we want this thing to grow and blow out the water. We want to have great conversations, great dialogue. So please, ma'am, sir, Facebook, Instagram, um, join us and get ready for some epic conversations and feedback and just kicking it and us just being key and kind. And just keeping it real. Y'all have a blessed night. I love y'all. Thank y'all for joining in. Thank and you until next time. Absolutely. Yes, that's what it's about, Tay. Just we want everybody to grow and prosper. And um we we want their perspective too, what they think about um certain things. We just got finished talking about the baby, so yes. Uh, we want to include everybody. So, again, thank you all for joining. I won't keep you all. You all have a blessed and fabulous evening. And be on the lookout for all of those things. Don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe. Um, businesses, if you have businesses, please inbox, comment, text message us so we can promote your business. We are all about growth and development. So, with that being said... Have a blessed evening so and nice. until next time.